Welcome back, Radix, to another episode this week. We're back on the piers. Finally, they finally opened the Alabama Pier, Gulf Shores Pier, right behind me. It's finally open, so I decided to do an episode on some sheephead. A lot of people have asked me how I've been catching sheephead, so this week's episode, I'm going to get down to the basics on how to help you catch your first sheephead if you're going out there. I'm going to be showing you the setups that I use, what town, town test line, what baits I use. Uh, there's two baits that you can use for sheephead, which are fiddlers and small shrimps. Even some uh, salmon you can find them, but it's very hard to find this time of year. So there's two main baits will help you guys catch. I'll be showing you everything from the hooks to the rods. Uh, this is your first time visiting my channel. Welcome to Real Addicted Adventures. We're going to get started and show you setups, get on some sheeps, uh, maybe help out somebody, give them one of my jigs, my frisky fit jigs for some sheephead. So, Enough talking, let's get started. So this is what we're using right here. Small size J-hook, one ounce pyramid, depending on the depending on the day. This is what you guys are using right here being hooked on the side now I'm gonna be dropping down there on the corner of the piling letting it drop down as I tell you guys and girls drop it down drop it all the way down drop it all the way down one two three four now what you all want to do is work with the columns from the bottom all the way to the top and just wait for the bite. Does sheephead is a very tricky fishing, so you do have to have some patience to get them. But once you get one, hold on to it because it's a hard fight. Make sure you guys tighten your drag because their initial run will be to the pilings that will wrap you around most of the time. So make sure you're ready every two to five minutes make sure to reel up a little bit sometimes they'll be on the bottom of the column sometimes they'll be in the middle and sometimes they'll be the top this will help you out also i would suggest 20 pound leader line even sometimes 15 depending how clear the water is for example today it's a little water is a little bit moving so i'm using a one ounce now when it's not moving as much you could even use a split shot which will help you. Like I said, small J hook or the frisky fins um, sheephead jigs, which I'll use next. I'm gonna use some shrimp. Might give one out to somebody, see if they like it, you know, so they could try it on and I can show you guys how good they are for sheephead and other type of fish like black drums and red drums. But main target of today is sheephead. This is gonna be a short video, me just showing you how to catch them. Oh my god, Riyadh, look at that. Nice that is a stud right there. Mm -hmm. Got him out right on time. Whew. He's not gonna lose that boy. I knew that was... Oh. Hope it doesn't break me off. Oh my god. There we go. Appreciate it, man. Hey, I appreciate it. Damn, there we go. First one up right now. Nope, not this one. We're just getting started. Next setup we're using is the Frisky Fins. Sheephead jigs. They sell them a lot in the base stores. You can also contact them through Facebook or Instagram. Basically what I'm doing for the sheephead is right here on the back side. There's two ways of doing it, back side right here, or through the top. I'm going to do it through the top so you guys can see. 
right here to the top to the horn and these are very good because you could drop it off the bottom and jig it and then work your way up like i told you guys in the other setup there it is i'll show you guys same thing i showed you guys in the, to the other setup i'm gonna drop it down until it hit the all the way to the bottom make sure it hits the bottom and get it as close to the padding as possible and basically it's a waiting game here sometimes they hit faster sometimes they take your time but it's a patience game with them and hopefully we'll make it happen maybe get one or two right quick go home and that's it the point of this video is to help y'all catch your first one out when you guys go out there <laughs> oh Net. oh my god that's the that's on the that's on the frisky fins uh on the freak those are the frisky fins ones that's the frisky fin with jigs right there i'm playing today matt <laughs> 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 yeah the color turns um see that they see it from far They took us one second, he dropped it and that was it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think it's the colors too. Mm -hmm. Then get a picture with the jig in his mouth. Okay. Do you think it works? I don't think it works. Look at that. Beautiful. Oh, on the frisky fins! <laughs> Yo! <laughs> <laughs> Big old black drum on the. F hey, does it work or not? It does. All right, Radics, hope this episode helped y'all guys out. Now get out there, go fishing safely, and hope you are, hopefully you get on some sheephead. Till next week.